good, STV gang and my fellow tarnished alike. We are back with a brand new rune exploit that has just been discovered on Reddit by a user named Maidenless2477, so shout out to you, bro. And I'm here today to bring it to you. Let me just tell you, it's an absolutely broken new method of rune farming after the latest patch. I believe that's 1.04.1. And it's going to net you. <clears throat> Wait for it. Wait for it. I know you saw it. 10 million runes every 35 seconds by actually duping Lord runes instantly. Um, once you set everything up, essentially you're gaining infinite Lord runes with this method. So before we jump in, please don't forget to like the video, drop a comment, and you better subscribe. Hit the bell for post notifications and to be notified when new Elder Ring videos drop. Maybe share the video. All right, so this new method has a little bit of setup, but fear not, it's pretty easy. So let's get started right away. I'm gonna do a quick rundown on the current meta farming spots, just in case anybody who's new here is not familiar with them. And they're both pretty solid still, especially for New Game Plus, but of course, we have here at Mog's Palace, the infamous chicken farming spot. Now, New Game Plus, this does get better. Uh, it's kinda a little bit slow, and I'll show you why in a minute. Um, but if you do have the Elden Beast weapon or whatever it's called, I still haven't even finished the game yet on my first playthrough, or Wave of Gold with the Golden Order Greatsword, uh, and then you'll be able to come and kill these dudes over here. Just to show you guys, I think in this newest update, they somewhat adjusted the chicken, or kind of nerfed it, for how often are procs uh, actually trigger and run towards the cliff. It seems now there's a higher chance you'll just hit them, and it'll do his dumb little back and forth dance, so... It's definitely taking a hit on how fast you can farm here by slowing down the rate of success, but I, I could be wrong. Okay, so, you know, we got that method. That's the usual. And then if we get on our horse, I guess there was a new method discovered where you run this way up the hill, take a left at the gateway here, and then you jump on the ledge, then jump off and swing your weapon. And apparently every swing nets you some decent runes, but no, this time, neither of these methods will be used today. So first things first, we need a few things to set this up, and it's all based on the system UI and the actual script of the game. It works on any platform. Uh, you're basically, don't ask me why there's, so, there's certain locations, actually two to be exact, that you actually need to trigger this. So to set it up, it should be fairly easy for you if you've got this map unlocked. You'll need one Lord Rune in your inventory, which you get from killing Mog. That's probably the easiest one that I know of. So we're going to stay here and actually, I'll show you quickly how to get to him because this is the location in which the dupe will occur, believe it or not. So we're still staying in Mog's palace. I don't know what's up with this place. It's like something's wrong. Like it's glitched. The entire map is glitched, and for some reason, data miners on Reddit found that the doorway to Mog's boss fight is bugged, and there is a way to trigger this glitch using this door to mess with the game script. So now that you see where we have to do the glitch, uh, we need to finish setting it up. So now that you have a Lord Rune, you'll need the Gold Scarab, as usual, Chicken Foot, as usual, but here's where you need a few other things. You're going to need a Rune Arc, okay? Put that to your hotkey. And any blood loss weapon along with any shield. Bear with me, this should be fairly easy. You can use Uchi Katana, any early game, it doesn't matter. Any blood loss weapon. So, like I said, bear with me, you'll see why. So make sure you have all of those items first. Then once you do, come to this doorway with the Lord Rune in your inventory and run through the door and go back out once to initiate the dupe. After this, hold on, it's not going to happen right away. You'll need to teleport directly to Limgrave Gatefront. It's just the easiest way. So, you know, once you get there, this is all part of it. Like you have to run in the door and then out and teleport immediately to this site of grace. So once you're here, get on torrent and run due east until you see an archway stone type mound of earth. Yeah. Veer off to the right side of it, but stay to the left. If that makes sense. Huh? Anyways. Veer off and you'll come across two eagles on the cliff side. Now these two eagles, something is up with them. Okay. This is the second step of triggering the glitch. You need to make sure your first teleport from Mog is directly here after you run in and run out of the door. And then once you stand in this spot, don't ask me why these two locations matter, but they do. So we're here. We stop 
and the whole spot here is between these eagles after they fly off we're going to jump up to this high rock and then use a rune arc followed by an immediate heavy attack then use the chicken foot followed by another heavy attack and teleport immediately back to mog and make a beeline for the boss doorway uh, this time i'm going to go to the other like the midway point and show you how to get up there and be in front of it because it won't work if you teleport back in so you're going to want to go up the lift all right so once you're here before you run through okay don't initiate it yet equip your blood loss weapon in your left hand this time and your shield in your right don't ask just do it once you do that run through the gate and shield whack heavy attack as you go through that didn't make sense then immediately run out the gate and jump off and when you die you'll reload and now every time you run through the door you'll get macaroni with the chicken strips oh got him <laughs> Yeah, I got you again. Oh, 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 oh Bobbage. Oh, yeah. 